Hey everybody, it's Mindy. And I have this package. It comes very interestingly wrapped in some, <laughs> I don't know. <laughs> Anyhow, it's a box in a black something. <laughs> I think I know who it's from. No guarantees, cause you know, it's kind of hard to keep track of what's coming these days. Tracking and all that, but anyhow. Um, okay, so I guess it's got that wrapped around it for some reason. And then it's in this. Okay, there's another address there and there was one on that. Two labels. Ah, go figure. I don't know. <gasps> anyhow, if I'm not mistaken, I think this is um, Diamond Painting Factory. Plain white box. Box looks in good shape. Um, we'll find out in a second. If I'm wrong, nope, it is. Okay, this is from Diamond Painting Factory. So that's how it comes. Ah, part of the box. I was like, something fell at me. All right, so it comes wrapped up like this, which is really nice. Okay, this is supposed to be a 40 by 50. Um, ordered July 13th, and today's August 3rd. So that's about three weeks, you guys. That's kind of like, you know, amazing, right? That's like it used to be. <laughs> that is like it used to be. So this is interesting. Oh, look. It's got, look, at, it's got my name on it. It's got the size. It's got the picture. And it's got 7-2-2020. 7-2, I think, is actually maybe when I ordered it. And July 13th, it shipped and I got notice. That makes some sense right there. All right. So it comes in this bag. Not certain how to open the bag like this. We can already tell that it's double sided adhesive, right? Yep. I was hoping for port glue, but doesn't look like it. So it comes very nice. I mean, looks great. I like the little uh, label on the outside of the bag. It tells you exactly what it is and who it's for. Look, Diamond Painting Factory. Look, he has my name on it there. <laughs> All right, well, we know who it's for, right? We know it's for me. Our drills are packed inside like this. Doesn't want to come out. Here we go. Oh, a long bag. Whew, long bag of drills, okay? And the tool kit, which has the middle metal tweezers, green boat, a squishy, and you do have a multi-placer on the end of your pink pen. So pretty basic tool kit. Stepped up with a multi-placer and a squishy. Oh, all right. Um, this image is beautiful. You guys, it's beautiful, beautiful, beautiful. Now look, this canvas looks, I mean, it looks great, doesn't it? It looks just great. Let's see if we can pull this paper back and not have any bubbles or rivers form. That's our goal. So I think this is all one piece of the adhesive. Yeah. Okay. Let's see. Just gonna loosen it at the top here carefully. Um, do I want to try to flatten it first? Let's see. And it looks beautiful. You guys, there's not a wrinkle, not a bump or lump or anything. Let's just carefully flatten it out a little bit like this. It looks, I mean, it looks beautiful. Kind of. All right, look at it. It looks great. It looks great, okay. Now let's go back to what we were trying to do here. We got it loosened up a little bit. We released it a bit. This is one piece of adhesive and it's not cut perfectly straight across. Like, look, if you can see right here. Yeah. Okay. So when I get to that point, I think it's gonna, gonna give me a little trouble. Anyhow. All right, let's go from this direction as well. That doesn't cover the whole thing, but then the glue doesn't, that's, that's how the tape is. The tape is just exactly the same. All right, let's carefully, carefully pull 
this back. All right. Now, let's see if I can lay this down again. It just, I hate pulling these back. I'm just so afraid to make my own problems, you know? And it looks so good like that, right out of the box. I don't want to mess it up. Okay, here's our drill field. Look at how clear it is. There's some of our symbols. Look how perfect this canvas is. I do not want to mess this up. I just don't. So let's carefully, carefully, carefully continue what we're doing here. All right, I'm gonna go like this. I'm gonna pull a little more back. Look at the colors. Oh my goodness, look at the colors. All right, now I'm gonna unroll this a little more because it's rolling back up on me. So unroll it a bit more and keep going. It's a 40 by 50, so it's big. It's beautiful though, you guys. It's gorgeous. Can you tell what it is? I bet you can. I cannot see what you see in the camera right now, but I can see what I see on the counter. Look at it. So pretty. There's a beautiful sunrise or a sunset on a beach. This gorgeous horse. Look at that. Isn't that pretty? I could go a little bit further. I don't want to pull it off, but just a little bit. Look at that. Isn't that pretty? Look at the colors in that thing. The oranges, the purples, the pinks and yellows. And that horse shows up perfectly. And the reflection. You can even see the reflection down here in the water of the horse. It's gorgeous. Just gorgeous. All right, look. I see a legend over here. There's one down here with a picture. And there's one up at the top with a picture and your DMC codes. We'll look at that in a second. I just wanted to get this flattened out and not cause any rivers or any bubbles. It is, it's like perfect, you guys, perfect. Yeah, there is nothing wrong with this canvas. All right, got my little straightener tool here and let's just slowly put it back on here. It is in great shape. For double-sided tape, it is in perfect, perfect shape. And then look how nice and flat it lays for me. It's beautiful. You guys, it's beautiful. I mean, if all double-sided tape was like that, I don't think we'd complain about it so much. It's when you have to fix all the bubbles in the rivers and stuff that, you know, we don't like doing that, okay? But wow, that's nice. Okay, so like I said, there is a legend down here on this corner, and there's one over here. We'll look at this one. There's the picture, the thumbnail. There's all of our DMC codes. Not a 310 in the lot, look at that. Not certain how many colors that is. Uh, Twenty-seven. Nice. Okay, let's just not mess with that. That's an excellent shape. Here are our drills. And you can tell they come in the little strips, the bags of, you know. But look at those colors. Um, this is a long skinny bag of drills, right? <laughs> Long and skinny. So, colors we're gonna have are gonna be purples. Now look at, this is cool. Let's see if I can get it the right way. 3836. Now these numbers are not huge on here, but they show up really well. They're kind of up at the top, and the numbers show up excellent. Round drill, as you can see. This one got smushed up at the top, <laughs> but it has round drills. Can be a lot of purples with this color. Mm. This color is gorgeous. Oh wait, there's more of them. They're wrapped around. There we go. 
917. Now there's no inventory sheet, so I don't know how many I'm supposed to have of each one. We just have to trust that we have enough. You know, as long as we have each color, we gotta hope there's enough of each one. So yeah, blues. Look at this, this one's pretty. That one is three, three, two, eight. I've never had that color. I don't think that's a pretty red. Super pretty red. So you saw the colors on the canvas. Orange, pink. Um, I mean, there's no orange. That red it looked like there was orange, but maybe not. We got lots of blues. We got some light pink. These are pretty. 224. I've gotten that recently. Now this one's in black. It's coming off a little bit on some of these bags, as you can see. But you can still tell what it is. Um, my guess is this might be 550. I did see 550 on the key. Look at that. So these are the little bags of like a hundred. So I mean that means we've got like one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, like a thousand of those. All right, and then the rest are like blues. And There's another purple though. 38, 34, that one's pretty. So you get it, you get the colors, right? I like the, how the, I like how they came this way. If you're gonna do these strips like this, I really kind of like this. There's just these nice long strips. Sorry, that's my hubby's phone going off. Sorry about that. We just got back from the hospital. You know, you had surgery, doctors are calling, you know, <sighs> sorry. Anyhow, back to what we were doing. Uh, if they're gonna do these little tiny little um, packets like this, I like how they laid them flat like this. I mean, I think they're so much easier to use that way. Um, yeah, I kind of like that. I can put them back in the bag nice and neat. So there's blues in here still, several blues, some creams, tans. But you saw the colors. It'll be really, really pretty. I really couldn't resist that. Um, I couldn't resist that painting when I saw it. It's horses, it's the sunset, it's just gorgeous. And it's a beautiful, beautiful canvas. Seriously, there's nothing wrong with it. Um, and it has, you know, just your typical letters and symbols over here. Now, it's supposed to be a 40 by 50. I did get my measuring tape. I tend to think that when you get the double-sided tape like this, most often they're actually true to size. So I'm gonna measure it real quick. I can see the image underneath there. From there to there, that's 40 guys. It is 40. Um, I think I told you it was 14.99 and that's 50. Yep, I very rarely get a double-sided tape that's not the actual size. So that's Diamond Painting Factory, $14.99. I actually think I ordered it beginning of July. They shipped it on July 13th. So it took about a month. I mean, you know, that is not bad. Look, it says UK, Diamond Painting Factory Company, UK. They were a UK company. Um, can't beat that in this day and age, you know, a month to get a diamond painting. <laughs> not too shabby. All right. So I'm gonna clean all this up, you guys, and put it all away, and um, yeah. Sorry for the interruption. Like I said, doctors calling, you know, stuff. Anyhow, it's harder to make videos when your husband's home after surgery. It's harder, harder. That's all I got. <laughs> all right, um, thanks for watching. Like button, subscribe button, you know, all those fun things that, you know, you do for your favorite YouTubers, right? Anyhow. I'll talk to you in the next video because I'm going to try to make one more while he's doing something else, okay? Alright, see you later.